Thank you. Thank you, my friends. I'm giving everything I have for this. Pushing these my limits. Get closer. Thank you, guys. By the river. Now it's time for breakfast. Scott toilet. Camp. Day three. First Inca ruin is up there. So we're gonna take that road right there. So at the top of the first Inca site, the stairs are pretty crazy, first thing in the morning. Um, yeah, it's very cool. I like it. Extremely good scenery. And uh, <coughs> we're going to continue up behind me with these mountains over there. ways to go. I guess it's like way up that, up that way. The stairs. Me and Mike right here is taking a cool picture. Get hiking. Lots more stairs. Hopefully we'll be there soon. Check out this view. All right, we got the fog problem settled. See what kind of view we got up here. What a view. Yeah. Head to the top of the steps. Finally. There's all these other mountains you can climb. And climb to this peak over here. Okay. 
Uh, we'll, we'll take it what, what we were seeing yesterday. Ain't no man oh, yeah. <laughs> I like the rock. Cameras everywhere, and I'm climbing down these steps, and they are wet. I'm a fucking idiot. Oh, I'm such a tit. I'm such a tit. <laughs> All right, a quick little break. Now back to it. Ninja style. Cliffhanger. Like a boss bitch. How you doing over there? Go. Got steps. For the first thing to run, those are some steep ones. Yeah, Ready for the steps. Okay, I hope so. The steps won't kill anyone. <sighs> Scares me. All right, I'm filming. Let's do it. Ice down someone's shirt. I can't wait for this. Yes. Yes. By the way. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> for that really well. I got it all on film. <laughs> Bathrooms. Squat toilets. I had to switch to this camera because I thought it was going to rain. But apparently it's not raining. That's all right. Life goes on. The hills continue. 
Still got that rock in my shoe. Focus on breathing. Wim Hof method, let's go. That was a cool cave. Very cool. Just gotta watch your step. All right, back to the trail. That's where we're having lunch. They are so awesome, they just gave me some awesome red drink. Let's see. Oh man, this drink tastes really good. What a surprise, hello. You eat that grass, yeah, just like that. <laughs> You're awesome for that one. Wow, this is so grand of right. river shite. Oh. Crazy and it's wet. They're very steep. Order. How they do that in this room. The rocks are really sketchy right now. 
very sketchy. I couldn't film most of it because I don't want to fall. I almost fell seven times yesterday walking down some of these wet rocks. The canopy is keeping me kind of dry though. Border. Okay, it's not as bad as I thought. <laughs> yeah, they're crazy. You got this. And these rocks are very slippery. The rain. Feeling good though. Mostly downhill. It's just a little get it gets a little hard on the knees from all the stomping on the rocks when you gotta go in the go down the big steps. It's hard for me to talk because I'm out of breath. It's a three hour or two hour hike down all these rocks. It's amazing, but you can't enjoy it as much as you'd like because you gotta look down so you don't fall off some fucking cliff. It just feels like you're in another world, truly. Are we getting, oh, whoa. That's 15 minutes. Oh, yes. We're almost there to these terraces. I've been really looking forward to these. Wow. Look at this. on the terraces. Beginning.
I don't know. Think I can make it? Okay. Yeah. I, I gotta be. Easy. If you fell, don't break any stones. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. <laughs> <laughs> Biggest, one of the biggest victories of my life. The people are coming. You see the terraces behind me? Awesome. The view from our campsite couldn't be any better. It's gone. Oh. It's gone. What was it? Bear. <laughs> well, I don't see it. <laughs> Where? I just saw it. There was a... Is that a bear? No, no, no. no, no. no, no. I just saw it twice. Yeah, the bear doesn't come here. It's so close. Three three in the morning. It started raining last night. <clears throat> you can hear it. Still running a little bit. But our journey starts soon. 3 3 in the morning, we gotta clean out our towels because it rained out last night. Alright, 3 30 a.m. trek. Yeah. It's almost 5 30. All the groups are waiting to go into Machu Picchu. I guess you have to wait till 5 30 until it opens. Like, shitloads of groups behind us. The line is moving, it's 5.30 almost, or close enough. Not that time. Welcome guys
was a good killer. Yeah, so happy. Now I'm happy because I just want to get those out of the way. The unicorn here. We made the steps. The gringo, the gringo killer steps. Those were actually worrying me the whole time. But now those are over. I'm truly really excited to reach Machu Picchu. Onward. We're at the Sun Gate with our group. has been covered again. Me. Oh, shit. I remember seeing this wall for many documentaries on this Machu Picchu. Machu Picchu. Your planning, finally here. Three long days. The line to take he and poop. Cost one so late. There you go. Been to Machu Picchu, my friends. 
Yeah. Can you see it good? Yeah. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah. We're here! Amazing! To my left hand side is part of the Sun Temple. And why this doesn't fall down yet if Machu Picchu has more than 500 years old? Why? Because this construction has a protu goes up and this block of rock has a hole. So that protu is going to join exactly here. And this never going to fall down even if you're going to have a heavy earthquake. That's the reason, guys. That's the coca plant. Only say coca, okay? That's the coca plant. As you know, this is not a tree, it's a little bush. Eh? That's the famous drugs, right? Guys, maybe you try already before in your life. So that's the first one, you know, the drugs, the coca plant, how they start, right? <laughs> so, this is a small botanical uh, garden when Hiram Bingham was here and he, uh, he left this type of flowers, plants in this area, right? The coca plant, this is the famous. Uh, uh, plant family of um, bromelia, you know, you know, bromelia or bromelasia, guys. This is a family of pineapple plant, right? The bears that we have in this area mostly eat this plant, guys. So that means our Paddington bears here are vegetarian, doesn't eat humans or animals, are vegetarian bears, okay? The sun. Is it? The reflection of that. Oh, oh, okay. oh yeah, yeah. Oh, how cool.
That was a fire pretty impressive. Goes pretty fast. Oh, we're at Machu Picchu. Oh my god, no, that's the picture of the bus. <laughs> See you soon. Yeah. <laughs> yes, it's very American. <laughs> Preference that you're traveling with Permarail. Have a nice journey. All right, train. Going back to where are we going back to? Oyante Tambo. Oyante Tambo. Oyante Tambo. Oyante Tambo is uh, Mark's. Oh, this is so the train. How long has it been stopped? Hmm. Over an hour. It takes two hours to get back. So what time will we get back? We could start now. Hmm. It's been two hours. Well, yeah, we've got to go up to Alan Taitambo, and then we've got to get across, which is two hours. Maybe quit. He looks quite angry, doesn't he? So what we have here is an escape attempt. We're all being held hostage on the train, and this guy's trying to get out. We've been held on the train now for two and a half hours. So these are local people that have gone for a walk? Yes. So is this footpath normally run across here? So they've got off the other train yeah. and walking. That's crazy. What is notches? What are notches? So how far down there is the other train then? Oh, 
We're going on four hours on the train. They say we'll be back till around close to midnight. The locals can leave the train. The foreigners have to stay on the train, so we're kind of trapped. But we're G Adventures and we make the best of things, as you can see. <laughs> got music, games. How long have we been on the train for? Oh, I don't know, about 11 to 10 bow hours. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we got on at, we got on at like what? Like 2 o'clock? We got on at 2 o'clock. What's it like, 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock now? It's half 8, 10 to 9. <laughs> oh, shit. 10 to 9. Oh wow. What's the nine? Yeah, we still have two. Here's, here's a poem for you. What's the time? Ten to nine. Hanky knickers on the line. When they drive, bring them in. Put them in the biscuit. Eat a biscuit, eat a biscuit. Eat your knickers by mistake. <laughs> well <laughs> done. Yeah. Oh my god, how's he gonna do it? Oh, oh fuck. He's doing it. He's doing it. Balls of steel. Balls of steel. <laughs> oh my, he's gonna rip that. He's gonna rip the hamburger sign off or the banyo sign. Whoa. That's very impressive. I can see the reflection of the menu on his window. He's so close. Welcome to Peru. Yeah. <laughs> I know, there's a roof of all the... Yeah. Oh my god, yeah. that is woof, to the nose. Wow. What are we going to do? Yep, they definitely take you to the next level. <laughs> Whoa. You can dream it, you can do it. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit, there's a car double parked. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is kind of how I feel when I find <laughs> What do you think about all this? Insane. <laughs> it's all about survival in this oh, yeah? trip. It's tradition to have a group celebration upon returning back. But we got back so late, everyone was too tired, and unfortunately, we all went to bed. The following day, we said bye to our group and hung out for a little while longer before enjoying a nice day around town without filming. <laughs> On our final day in Peru, we decided to do some zip lining. A zip line at the very top of the mountain. How's it going? <laughs> yes, I think. I, saw, I see many cameras. Eh? <laughs> yeah.
upside down, just normal. <laughs> Go ahead. All right. Okay, my friends, enjoy. Okay, so so okay, so okay. so I just uh, okay. Okay, left hand break, other hand hold on. Okay, so, so I just kind of guide it for now, but yeah. don't don't. This speed. hand is gonna just kind of stay on top of that. Okay. The other hand is gonna just kind of go like that, not even barely touch it. Okay. You so, kind of keep on both. So, so kind of glide with it, I guess. Yeah. Don't squeeze. Okay. You can even kind of keep this hand on here for a little bit and then switch. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right, man. Here it goes. <laughs> Yeah. Hi. Here? Oh. Here? Okay, so we did the first two and they were fucking awesome. Fucking awesome. Superman. Now let's do the third one. Of course I stopped way too soon and there's a zip liner right behind me and I was very oh. freaked out. Oh. Oh. Huh? Oh. 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 Okay. Yeah, it's good? All right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Uh, huh. oh, thank you. Thanks, bro. Uh, awesome. Oh, come here. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Woo. See you, man. Yeah. Hey, yeah, remember, eh? Hey, Mars Adventure. Yeah, yes. Share your video, please. Oh, yes, I will. Yeah. I will. Thank you. thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> uh, incredible. That was incredible, man. That was some of the best fun I've had in a while. Yeah, that could have been very bad.
our last day here. So, wow, so much fruit. It's all fresh. It's very crowded on this Saturday. So this is our last night in Cusco. We're on the roof of our hotel getting some great time-lapse shots. Um, tomorrow we head to Argentina, to Buenos Aires. I think we'll be there um, until Halloween, and then we leave the day after. And then we go to El Calafete, which is on the other side of the country. And we're going to start doing all the glacier tours and all the national park tours over there. Uh, it's gonna be really fun, really looking forward to this. I mean, it feels like we've been to the end of the earth and back already with this uh, Inca Trail trek. It was insane, but we're still here. <laughs> it's like we're going a million miles an hour. We've done everything. We're still kind of tired, but uh, the journey continues and it will get even crazier. So I will talk to you soon, friends. See you in Argentina. things about this place let's give it a try let's give it a try and by the way the, the, the traffic here they don't give a shit if you're walking you better get out of the way or they're gonna run you over here <coughs> see what watch this see oh, oh fuck bust <laughs> our pony track fucking bus just almost hit me but the camera didn't see it <laughs> I'm happy, I, I'm, ha I'm happy I wasn't you because you had to watch it almost hit me. <laughs> You're doing a video about it almost happened. <laughs> oh my god. Fucking crazy, man. Alright. <laughs> Good dinner. I almost came by a bus, but I didn't. Alright. Successful night. <laughs> That's some talent right there. Holy shit. <laughs> So they lift that from, I think they're lifting it from floor to floor. Um, can they do it? Can we see from our window? No, we can't. Oh shit, oh shit. They probably think I'm an asshole for not helping. Oh my god. <laughs> Jenny up the stairs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, YouTube. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, agarre, agarre, no? Agarre, agarre. I came from down there all the way. Oh shit! Oh shit! I believe in you. Muscle, muscle, you got it. <laughs> Wow, I'm so happy right now. Oh my god, these dudes are amazing. 
Okay, they make Americans look like sissies when it comes to furniture shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah! Wow! Um, wow! Excelente! <laughs> Muy bien! <laughs> Bravo! Bravo! <laughs> uh, <laughs> give, give these guys some medals. That is amazing! Wow! What a miscuse guy! Yeah, yeah. Uh, Holy shit! Yeah, yeah. What a beautiful night. Our last night here. I thought we'd go on the roof and try for some uh, night shots. It's actually really cool. You probably won't be able to see it that close in detail, but that's the Jesus statue way... Oh, you can see it a little bit. Yeah. It's lit up at night. How cool is that? Yeah. Oh, what a great touch. It's like a big... It's like a star way out in the distance. Our Peru adventure has come to an end. I was so fortunate to have such a wonderful group of people. There were no whiners, there were no complainers. Everyone was here and everyone was ready to do the trail. Our group had such a perfect chemistry. Everybody looked out for one another. Everyone encouraged each other. What truly baffles my mind is that these people came from all over the world to this one remote area, chose this exact tour at this exact time of the year, and here we all are. The randomness of all this truly amazes me. We started this journey as strangers, and we left as friends, and I am truly grateful and happy to have met each and every one of them. And I'll never forget the memories and good times that we all shared together. Our group, my friends. We had the best guides you could ever ask for. David and Raul were down to earth. They joked around with us. They made us feel comfortable, safe. Aside from all the wonderful sights we saw, our guides made this trip shine. But this trip would not have been possible without the porters. They are the backbone of this entire operation. They are truly superheroes, and I have nothing but admiration and respect for all of these individuals. They would leave after us, pass us up, set up camp, have it all ready. By the time we got there, they cooked all the meals, they set everything up, took everything down. On our final night on the trail, we had the tipping ceremony where we get to tip the porters, and we get to say whatever we'd like to say to them and let them know how we feel. It was an amazing moment that was shared between them and our group. You have lots of time to yourself on this trail, lots of time to think, to analyze every aspect of your life, to get to know your group mates, hear their stories, share your stories with them, and it is very refreshing. On a trek like this, you experience a roller coaster of emotions, and that's what separates an adventure from a vacation. A vacation is all nice and bubbly and planned out and perfect. An adventure, there's a lot of uncertainty and you never know what you're gonna get into. You experience joy, happiness, doubt, fear, struggle, gratitude, perseverance. And in the end, it helps you grow mentally, spiritually. You really know a lot more about yourself after a journey like this. I wanna thank everyone for taking the time out of their lives to watch this film. And I hope I've given you some insight and a little bit of a preview of what it's like to hike the Inca Trail, to travel, to get involved in all the craziness. And if you get the opportunity, make sure you hike the Inca Trail to Machu Picchu because the destination is nothing without the journey. This truly was adventure of a lifetime. And I will end on this. Any adventure on earth is just a plane ticket away. And next time we fly to Argentina to Buenos Aires, stop there briefly, and then fly to the edge of the continent to explore Patagonia with all of its wonders and splendor. Get ready my friends, the journey continues. Enjoy the bloopers. We thought we would see dogs fucking, but we were wrong. <laughs> Even better. Wow, you're on 360 camera. No, they're fucking on 360 camera. How about that? Oh wow. Okay. Let's yeah. get a, let's get a good side angle. Okay, there we go. All right. All right. Now we know exactly what's going on. Pump action. Shit situation. Episode one. You cannot flush your toilet paper in Peru, so you throw them in a garbage, and I won't show you the paper in there because that's gross. But that's the way it is. What's up, guys? Can you film this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gotta be bumpy too. <laughs> Yes, yeah. Can you sneeze I on guess. my bike? <laughs> <laughs> you okay, sir? Yeah. You are rubbing right. your tummy. I'm good. Get out of the way. Mind, mind your picture? How about now? Oh, uh, no, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no.
No Nintendo? No way, I love Nintendo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> I know it's avocado. <laughs> no s'mores? Oh man. <laughs> I love your hat, but that's a cool design on it. Thank you. Very cool. All right, are you ready? No. Are you are? Do you want a pink or the other one? A regal chair. Pink! Perhaps we can match with you there. Okay, perfect. <laughs> First pile of shit. We're too close, it's a sheer cliff. Oh, you know the drill? We've got the rest of our group behind us. There we are. I seem to get in these fits while I'm speaking. How do you feel about that? You sound like that Vince Regal look off of the rest of them. Ever wondered how these travel videos are filmed? Ever wanted to see the man behind the scenes? Want to know what he uses as his tool of choice? Or who his best friend is? The other guy. <laughs> this is a tale of two guys on, on the trek. The they come on. Going to sideways. Oh, little donkey. So this little donkey. Hello, mate. Hello. So on a scale of one to ten, how good is it? Uh, it's an eight. That's good. That's good. Really? Could be colder. Colder. Yeah, that's funny. If, if you won the lottery, would you fill a pool in it and swim in it? Yeah. Right on, right on. Yes, I would. Do you think you'd be as, as buoyant as regular water, but in the juice? That I don't know. Only only time will tell? Only time will tell. So Let's I hope get you, rich and get a pool. I hope you win the lot of my friend. Okay. Yeah. That, that was an English bloke called... Oh, hello. Keep, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he bends over right when I film him. Hi, Jesse. <laughs> if you're Still seeing up. this, we are all dead. <laughs> all right, here we go. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, I hope he doesn't take a shit right now. That'd be horrible. <laughs> Hello, bud. Can't leave them alone. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot leave the cock alone. You've got them asses and cocks. <laughs> All true. <laughs> They're contagious, man. What can I say? <laughs> oh, that was gold right there. That's going, that's going the outtakes for sure. You're missing Carlos? Oh! Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm making a video. <laughs> What's that? Right there, you bloody fuckers. Getting Here close. 4,000 feet. 4,000 meters. 4,000 fucking meters. 4,000 meters. We're, right get, there. we're getting really close to the top. Meters, 200 meters more. We're at the fucking top. The fucking top, indeed. Oh, the shaggy boobies. Yo, hombre. Hasta mañana. Oh, man. Yeah, get into Sweating out my ass. <laughs> Are you? Literally. Yeah. Yeah, let us wet. How's your, how's your butthole? Do you want to see my tushy? Perfect. Thank you. Step by step. Holy shit. Never done in years. Oh, the rock in my shoe. It's no fun. Oh, I was gonna grab that. <laughs> I didn't want to get in your video. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking stairs, man. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. Almost right. going on my ass on these. This is the fucked up, man. It's like we're in Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings. Bet your hide orbits.
for the film. For the film. High elevation. I still do it for you guys. I love you. Onward. Kiss him. I want a selfie. You can, you can share. I really want a selfie. Yeah. Oh, I just stepped in horse shit. Yeah. He's stepping in some sort. I can't even see that fucking step. Okay, I'm stopping this film. Mike, you are in the picture. Those little strap things are good, aren't they? What happened? It's a, fucking broke. It's a lot of llama shit. Yeah. Pass it yeah, on. Yeah, man. Yeah, pass it on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're going. You have yeah. to go out of the park to take shits and pisses. Jesse, <laughs> what did you just say? Oh, I, I was letting our viewers know that we're leaving the park so we can take shits and pisses. Shits and pisses. Because, <laughs> because. Yeah. Shits and giggles. Yep, shits and gigs. Yep. <laughs> Because you have to leave the park to, for this. There's no eating here, and no shitting, and no pissing in here. So I gotta leave to do all those. Which we're doing right now. So as Carl Watson would say to the people who took the bus, you lazy fucking bastards. Lazy fucking bastards. You lazy fucking bastards. We made the trek. We truly earned Machu Picchu. To all the people who took the bus, lazy fucking bastards. Right, Carl? Hmm? Right. <laughs> I, was, I was talking to a Carl Watson dude. Ah. Okay, one second. Oh shit. <gasps> Hi, Mama. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the 258 service from Christopher. Virtual Beach, you to Alante Temple. We're currently waiting on traffic lights. It's a lot of stuff. You heard the man.